now because I just bleached my hair and it like probably bleached them all off. But um, damn, there's a lot of y'all on here. What the fuck? Oh y'all, just casually putting on my makeup for work. Um, for those of y'all that don't follow me, I do bottle service. So in Houston. <laughs> We also kind of like promote too for the club. Um, so like that's like the first part of our job, but it's actually really fun. It does get a little overwhelming sometimes, but if any of y'all are from Houston, um, go to Height Social, Heart in Claypool. I guess if you're from Houston, you probably know of all those places, but that's where I work. So we work at all of the venues. Clay is only doing during the day right now. So yeah, which I like that better. I'd rather work during the day than at night, but you know. Um, but yeah, I have to get there at nine. I usually work Friday, Saturday, and Sunday during the day. Now that Claypool has started, it starts in March and ends in October. It's every Sunday. And a lot of the Sundays we have like big DJs like Steve Aoki opened for us this year. And then um, John Summit usually comes at one point. Um, yeah. So let's see. Should I put on like actual face makeup? I'm debating on it. Hmm. Maybe like a tad. I just feel like that's what was breaking me out. I'm literally just gonna do like this much and kind of mix it in. Just to, you know, even it out or whatever. And just wanna play with I live 35 minutes away, which is fine. I like driving. Um, it's never an issue for me, but I usually go on live whenever I'm at work. So if you want to hop on later, follow me so you get a notification, you know. But um, yeah. Tonight, what are we wearing tonight? I don't know. I we don't put our outfits on till we get there, so I won't be able to show y'all. But um, it's cute, and it's usually some sort of lingerie set that we wear on top of shapewear. We don't just wear lingerie. I don't work at a strip club, so um, yeah. And then we wear like our heeled boots. So, but first, before we do that. We always go promo. So like we go to other bars and we try to, you know, get people from those clubs to come to ours. Um, it's honestly kind of fucked up, but who cares, you know? So that's what we do first. Tonight I'm working at Heart. So my favorite one to work at is for sure Hide Social. And we're also opening up a more like during the day thing called Boulevard Park. And it's gonna have like beach volleyball and all this shit. So that will be fun. I think it's opening, it's supposed to be next month, but you know how that goes. Um, someone asked for my Twitter. I don't use Twitter, so. Um, I mean, you could try looking at my name, but you're not gonna see anything, but like two reposted tweets from like four years ago. So yeah, um, I post on Instagram a lot. So if y'all want to go follow me on that, that would be great. But yeah, last night we went out and I didn't work last night. So we just went to Bottle Blonde first, which I'm not the biggest fan of Bottle Blonde, but it's not like that it's like a bad place. It's just not really my vibe. Um, So we went there and then we went to 
hide social where I do work, but I wasn't working. We just went to go like show up and so we kind of get like points for going on nights that we're not working. Um, and then we left there and we went to Sincerely Tipsy, which is a bar that one of our clients is like a big promoter at. So we go there a lot and it was a lot of fun. <coughs> I have allergies. <coughs> but yeah, it was a lot of fun. I woke up at like noon. Oh yeah, and then after that, we went to after hours, but it wasn't really like after hours. We were just kind of like, you know, everything's closed. And so we know this one guy that owns this new bar that just opened. So he stayed open like just for us to go and chill there. But I was kind of like ready to go to sleep at that point. I was like, no, I kind of want to just go to bed. So we did end up crashing somewhere. And <clears throat> I usually drive home after work. So we all are gonna say, oh my God, drinking and driving, so bad, it's illegal. Um, yeah, there's people who know how to drunk drive and there's people who don't know how to drunk drive. And in my opinion, there's people who should not drink and drive, like, at all. But some people, like, it really doesn't affect their driving. So that's all I'm going to say on here, because I'm not trying to have the fucking, you know, FBI after me or whatever. But that's just my take on it. <clears throat> Agree or don't disagree. Do I have tattoos? No, I don't have any tattoos. Um... Nor do I think I'll ever get one. So just not really my thing. Um, I change my mind on that type of shit all the time. So yeah. Um, <clears throat> and I really think I'm not a big fan of tattoos on girls. I mean, to each their own. But personally, I think a lot of them just look like weird. Like not weird, but it just like looks random. So um I think spine tattoos actually on girls are cute, but again, like I feel like I would probably regret it. So that and like spine tattoos kind of have a bad stereotype to go with them, I would say. Um, and also like I'm trying to get more into modeling and getting a tattoo is probably the worst thing that I could do, so. Yeah, I do have my belly button pierced, but I took it out. I've been kind of wanting to put it back in, but I don't know. I feel like everyone just has taken theirs out now. Not that I want to be like everyone else, but it's like, why? Um, my dog got into the toilet paper. So that's cute. Sadie, come here. No, because you're going to jump my stuff. Come here. Try and get her to come here with me. Sadie, come here now. Come on. Okay, so yeah, she's staying in here with me. Do you come from? I'm from Houston, Texas. So it's very hot down here right now. It's in like, I guess it's not really hot. We usually get up to like 105, 110 during the summer. 
but it's still like 80 degrees here right now and it's April, so it's pretty normal for Houston. Um, do you have piercings? Yeah, I talked about that earlier. I have my belly button pierced, but that's it. So, yeah. Go IG, why? Okay, there's a couple people have said that. Why would I go live on Instagram versus here? I don't know, I just like never really, every time I've tried to go on Instagram live, it's just a bunch of people that I know on there. Like not people, like there's not really a for you page for that shit. I mean, I guess there is, but I never get on it. So going on uh, TikTok live is way more beneficial for me, for sure. So that's what I always do, TikTok live. Oh, uh, this is just um, bronzer, so it just makes me more tan, I guess. Put on like three layers of this shit. So I'm trying to look sun-kissed. I did lay out like all day today. Um, so that was fun. But... Um, I didn't get as tan as I thought I would. I mean, I guess I'm like decently dark, but not as much as I'd want to be. So, yeah. Okay. Oh, my nose contour. I almost always forget that. Is it? Um, yeah, I like to leave here at 8.15. It's a like 40, 35, 40 minute drive. Um, but I park across the street because it's cheaper. And yeah. um, I'm getting ready for work, so hurts in the ass what I'm doing. Um, it's not itchy, my allergies. I'm getting ready for work, so I gotta be there at 9 p.m. So, yeah. You student. Um, yeah, it sounds really messed up, but we do have to pay to park because only at this venue, because like the company that I work for doesn't own the valet guys or whatever. So, um, actually, no one has asked me for that today yet. Surprisingly, there are usually other people, which I'm confused about. Um, no, so I used to be in college. I did, I used to be in college, but I didn't really like it. <laughs> so, I'm taking like, two classes right now just like on the low like online but it's just not really my thing i used to um i used to go to Ole Miss but i quit going wait just sort of server um okay like so i do bottle service so i guess i'm like a cocktail waitress officially it's called a cocktail waitress but and like kind of like promoter as well um so yeah it's fun but like we do get to drink during work which is fun like we're just not supposed to get too fucked up you know what i'm saying but like why is this so itchy like really? Like, I don't want to itch my makeup off. Like, damn. It's, like, really bothering me. Okay. But anyways, um, yeah, I did used to be in college. I just didn't really like it. And it wasn't really my thing. Like, I kind of knew that I didn't really want to do college or, like, care about it when I was in high school. But I went anyways for, like, the experience. And 
um, you know, just like say I have a degree, I guess, but do you so you get hit on all the time by guys? Um, yes and no. Like most people are pretty respectful. Um, I know just be like, hey, like you're really beautiful or something like that. Um, but I would say like I don't get hit on any more than if I was just like going to the club. Yeah, I just, like, I don't have that attention span. And also, like, um, whenever I went to Ole Miss, like, it just wasn't my thing. Either I should have gone to, like, Arizona State or something, but the SEC school life was not for me because I live really close to Texas A&M and College Station, and I can tell you it is way, way more fun than Ole Miss was. So, well, I kind of... Be that bitch but 